Hey, what's up guys? We're back in the high pixel UHC. Ooh, we spawned right by cows. You know what that means? Can make the backpack. You guys do know how much I like my backpacks. And I also spawned right by a desert, so I'm gonna be spending like a couple minutes searching for either a temple or a village, of course. Because I always have to do it when I see a desert. I'm actually kind of hoping that I find a village this time so that I can get uh, carrots and possibly an emerald trade so I can craft Exodus because I haven't actually crafted Exodus in a really long time and a lot of people have been suggesting for me to craft it in a game. So uh, I want to see if I can try and do that. Oh, and that's a village right over here. Really, really hoping they have carrots here still. Hopefully nobody else has found this place yet. It is pretty far from zero zero, so I had doubt that anybody's found it. Let's check out this blacksmith first, what we got. Ooh, three pair of iron boots. Let's go. All right, here we go, dude, we got carrots, nice. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look through these villagers and see if I can find one that's got a coal trade or like anything I can trade for easy emeralds. Oh, okay, we found a coal trade, perfect. All right, so we're just gonna dig this guy in a hole real quick. I'm gonna type the cords here just so I remember. I'm gonna have to dig down here pretty quick because we're pretty close to the border, so I'm gonna need to get uh, all the coal to trade for him. So what I'm trying to craft here is Exodus, which is a helmet that regenerates a small portion of health when hit on a two second cooldown. So basically every time I damage somebody, I will regain a heart every two seconds. And I would say it's probably one of the most overpowered crafts in Hypixel UHC. And it takes five diamonds, a head, a golden carrot, and two emeralds to craft. And since I found a village, I'm gonna trade uh, my coal for two emeralds. I got carrots so I can make the golden carrot. So I just need five diamonds and a head. And I'll have one of the most overpowered crafts in this game. If I could find five diamonds down here in the strip mine or like in a cave and be up at like PVP, I'd be so set. Really, really hoping I can do that. Oh, perfect. We got diamonds. I'm really hoping that it's at least seven so I could make Exodus and a sword. But if it's not, that should still be fine. I have to go up pretty quickly because if I don't, the uh, village is going to get eaten by the border. So I'm not going to be able to actually trade for the, uh, for the for the emeralds with the coal. But yeah, I did get eight diamonds, so I can't make a sword and I can make Exodus. This is going to be actually so good. This is going extremely well. Like, wow, I did not really expect this one to, to go so well. Ooh, there's an Enderman here. I do have two gunpowder. I could actually craft a uh, Book of Toth as well and get a fire aspect sword. All right, well, it's only a minute after PvP and I already have everything I need. So now I just gotta go trade for my emeralds, get ahead, and um, get to have Exodus for the rest of the game. All right, I think I hit this guy right here. Yep, here he is. Two emeralds, there we go. Well, I see a name underground over here. Being able to kill this guy right here would be perfect so I could get a head and be able to craft Exodus right now. Let's hope he's not stacked. I'm gonna go down here. Oh, he's not even full iron. I think he's AFK. Dude, what is this? I'm not gonna complain about that. I don't really know what happened there, but uh, I get the free head. So I guess it's time to uh, craft the Exodus then. There we go. Most overpowered crafted in the game. Oh, dude, there's a fully enchanted guy over here. I still don't have any enchants on my sword, so I need to be careful with this. I was just coming over here to get this cane to enchant my sword, but I don't know. I'm gonna see if I can try and take this guy out, though. If I can get a nice lava on this guy, I could probably take him out pretty easy. Yeah, he's already on 12. He's healing. He hit his only gap. I got him in the lava. I'm gonna run, I'll run away a little bit, though. I need a corn. I'm gonna place a block right here. I got him glitched in it, and I can combo him. He's on 10. Not having an enchanted sword is really hurting me right here. Yeah. I think I can kill him here now that I've healed up a little bit. Yep, perfect. Alright, now I can craft my belage rod here pretty quickly. And here's my book of Toth, so I can make sharp to fire. And I'm gonna make a G-head. I still don't have that much stuff, but I still have Exodus, so I'm, I'm looking pretty good. I see people fighting over here too. This would be a really good clean for me. I saw one have a rod, and I really do need a rod so I can win this game. I'm gonna go in on this guy because he's still high health. He's not bad, that's for sure. But, okay, I can kill him there. And the other guy's on 12. I still have speed, so if I can hit him once, he's probably dead. Perfect. Not bad. Dude, everything seems to be going my way this game. Alright, I see a guy behind me. I'm gonna act like I'm looting. I'm gonna turn on him. And he should be dead pretty soon. Actually, I'm dying. Oh my god, I'm so low. He's on zero. Okay, he's dead there. Perfect. Alrighty here, I can make two more G heads. And a sharp three fire, one diamond sword. There's only 12 people left already. This game's gone pretty quickly. I see another full iron, dude. I haven't seen like any stacked players yet. Ooh, there's a full diamond over there though. I'm probably gonna have to bow this guy down a bit. 
I can get a lot of health back if I bow him as well, so. Oh, he's trying to head rush me. That's not good. Need to keep running a bit. I'm gonna have to play pretty annoying because I'm only one piece and he's full diamond, so I'm not gonna do like any damage to him. And I'm gonna get shredded. Well, you just gotta do what you gotta do. And plus, if I bow him, I get health back for free. Yeah, I think he's realized that I'm just gonna bow him. He's already running away. Okay, I think I'm gonna fight this full iron then. Might as well. Okay, this guy sees us fighting. I'm gonna turn back on him. Oh no, this is not good. This full iron is kind of ruining this. Exodus is so strong though, because I can just keep getting my health back for free. Wait, there's a one piece over here. Is he gonna go fight the full diamond? Dude, I'd really like to fight this one piece so I could be half, but I'm not sure if that's gonna happen. Also, the full diamond guy is a little bit mad because I'm bowing him, but it's like kind of my only choice. Alright, I'm getting this one piece away from the other two people. I'm gonna turn on him with a G head here. Hopefully, I can drop it. He just ate a G head as well. Had he did another. Yeah, he's up pretty high health. Yeah, I think he has a decent amount of G heads as well. It's on 10. He had another head. I think I can drop him here. Okay, perfect. He burned to death. Okay, we got half diamond now. He had King's Rod. And I can make my last G head. Oh, I can make boots. So I can be three quarters now. That definitely does change things. Me being three quarters and having Exodus is so much better. Dude, I haven't been able to find anybody for a while. It's about to be deathmatch. Dude, the Chrome guy is fighting somebody as well. He's getting really low. I think he's gonna die. Oh wait, do I see them over here? I think I see him over here. If I could clean this before DM, oh my god, that'd be so perfect. Oh my god. If I can get this clean, there's actually no way. There's no way. He's so tanky. Oh my god, dude. I can't believe that just happened, dude. He had fusion pants. Okay, I just got so stacked off of that clean. I cannot believe it. Alright, well, I might as well make a little bit more fusion armor. Let's see what we can get here. We got a, we got a helmet, which is not that great because I have Exodus. Let's try and reroll. And I got pants, which I already have. Okay, well, that's a little bit unfortunate, but that's fine. Four other people left. I'm not sure if they're going to be that stacked. There's this full iron guy right here. Are you kidding me? Are they all full iron? No way, dude. I can't believe this. Wait, this guy's knockback too. I'm flying. He's making me fly. Okay, I'm going to leave that guy for now then. I'm going to go after all these kills over here. All right, sleepy bacon. I'm sorry. It had to happen though. Oh, that guy actually got a kill. It's a little bit unfortunate. I kind of wanted that. Come here, buddy. Dude, his knockback too is so aggressive. Dude, look, I'm flying. He's already on eight though. Trunk Kermit's coming in for the clean. And he's getting crit. He's so bad. Poor guy. <laughs> Alright. The 1v1 of the century, dude. He's on 10. I don't feel like messing with this guy. Just gonna just wanna 1v1 him. His knockback too is so aggressive. It makes me fly so far. And he's gonna burn to death? No, he's on one. There we go. <laughs> like, if I won that game, that was so weird. Like, I, sometimes you just get really lucky, I guess. 10 kills, though, not bad. Not bad. I still got the most kills in this game. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please feel free to hit the subscribe button in the top left. If you guys have any more suggestions for uh, things for me to craft or any strategies for me to do in this game, please feel free to leave them in the comments. And if you want to watch some more of my videos, there'll be one in the top right of your screen. Anyways, I hope you guys have a great day, and later.